Lone Rider here, and uh, a little while ago I put up a video about how to disable the defective seatbelt uh, sensor on the um, on the Subaru Crosstrek. Um, turns out it didn't work. Uh, once again, I had cargo on my seat and it was beeping again, telling me that I needed to buckle my passenger in. But of course, I had no fracking passenger. You know, and I'm getting real sick of these car companies telling us. Uh, Buy cars with ever more advanced features where the car does things for you, like auto braking, auto lane keeping, which used to be called your fracking eyes, you know, stuff like that. And when people like myself get skeptical of these features, they say, well, don't worry, we've thought of everything. Yeah, the same engineers who haven't thought of a single reason that there might be weight on the passenger seat besides for a human arse, like somebody puts a backpack there or a bag of groceries, they, they, they can't literally think of any other reason for weight being there except for somebody sitting on the seat. It's almost like they've never driven a car before, right? <laughs> um, and there's no apparently no way to shut this damn thing off, and I'm very frustrated. I'm gonna, when I, I have to take the car in on Tuesday, I'm going to tell them if, they, if there's no cutoff switch, if there's no way to disconnect it, just start cutting wires because there's no way I'm going to be tolerating this crap anymore. It's defective. You know, the, the definition of defective essentially is the only time it goes off is when it's not supposed to. And that's what we have here. So this, yes, you should always wear your seatbelt. You know what? I wear my seatbelt as the driver. But we're talking the passenger seat that has no passenger in it. And there, it, this stupid thing is, is really getting on my nerves. So this is defective and they need to fix this. And I really hope they do a better job with their next car. Um, but, you know, if, if they keep doing stuff like this with the Subarus, I'm not going to be buying the next, the next car from them. You know what I'm saying? Um, it, this is really, really a, a shitty design. Excuse my French. Lone Rider out.